Hi YouTube, this is Tom. Uh, I'm not going to do a long video today. Uh, I was either going to talk about, again, a part two in the Illuminati and the music industry, but I've kind of uh, decided to derail from that. Um, I want to talk to you guys about a dream that I had last night. It was uh it wasn't a dream that I had during like my sleep last night. It was uh I took a nap earlier yesterday after I got out of school because I go to school really early. And uh I took like a two, three hour nap and I had a, a very vivid dream during that time. I had already made a video about this right after my sleep, but I was kind of groggy, so I didn't want to show myself being pretty groggy after that. So I uh decided to make a new one. Anyways, in my dream, it was it was really vivid. It, it was it was an earthquake dream. I've never had something that vivid before, but it, it showed me a map of uh, three major earthquakes that uh, were about to happen. One that was on the end of the Caspian Sea, on the eastern side of the Caspian Sea, there was a big earthquake. One right near Greece. There was a huge earthquake, and then one within the United States. I think it was on the west coast. I can't exactly remember. It was. It, it wasn't blurry at the time, I just honestly forget where it was in the dream in, in the United States, but there were these three major earthquakes that happened, and they were quite alarming, and people were really scared, and I remember in my my dream that, um, in, in the dream, I was in kind of like a, I don't know, it was kind of like a high-rise or what whatnot. Anyways, I, um... I was in the bathroom and uh, I was just looking like I don't know picking something out of my teeth or whatnot and um, all of a sudden there was a big jolt like the the ground jolted up and down and the power went out and the power was connected to the door and uh, when the power went out I couldn't open up the door so me and a friend were in the bathroom at the same time and I tried opening up the door and the door wouldn't open until the power went back on so once the power went back on we rushed downstairs it was, we were like two three flights of stairs we were going to take the elevator and once we got down there uh... we went out into the the street and there were like a couple of people out in the street already that you know had noticed that w what was happening and there was this girl that was like i don't know she looked like a girl from um... what movie is it um, Monsters Inc. Yeah, that little girl from Monsters Inc. And instead of black short hair, she had long brown hair, and she sounded the same way. And all of a sudden, the earth started cracking, and it started cracking open. And she fell in the crack, and it swallowed her up, and it killed her. And everybody just around us started getting swallowed up in these cracks because the earth was opening up, and everybody was dying. Buildings were falling in, and it was a lot like 2012, so it was kind of weird. So I jumped the gap. Um, and just in the in the end, I died too. But you know, everybody that I knew in the in the dream died. But it was just it was really, really graphic, really creepy, really scary. Um, and then I woke up right when I was falling in the gap, and I, right before I hit the ground, I woke up and I was like, gasping for air, and I was sweating, and it was just a really really vivid dream. Anyways, I I said I don't claim to to ever be a prophet or you know, claim that my dreams have ever come true. I'm just saying that this dream was about the most vivid dream I've ever had, ever, uh, earthquake-wise, and just dream-wise in general. Uh, I think I have to lay off the ice cream and chocolate, because uh, they're really giving me bad dreams, especially the pizza. The pizza's really giving me, I don't know, I like DiGiorno and stuff, but I think I got to steer clear of DiGiorno, they're giving me some freaky dreams, I don't know if that's the, the case, but anyways, these dreams are really creepy, and, um, I don't know, luckily my kitty was there, and she was, uh, it, <laughs> she was the one that initially woke me up, she's right here right now, I'll show you, she was taking a nap and trying to close her eyes. Wake up, kitty, wake up, wake up. Meow, meow, meow. Wake up, kitty. Can you? Meow. Anyways, I gotta let you guys go. On. Uh, I have a lot of stuff to do. All right, talk to you guys later. Uh, talk to you guys more about other stuff later. Bye, guys.